Hello, it's Nickstock here, and this is a simple guide on how to download and install our instruments. To do so, first of all, you need to download the instrument that you want to play. To do so, you just have to go on the releases section of the instruments GitHub page. Please notice that I will mention a lot of links, and you can find them all uh, in the description of this video. As an example here, I will download Netitar, but the procedure is the same for any instrument. Just go on the uh, latest release of the instrument and click on Assets. You will find a zip file. Click on this and it will, be, uh, it will download it. <coughs> now just place it anywhere on your, on your disk, on your PC. Extract it using your uh, zip managing application and it will find a folder. You can move this folder anywhere. You don't have to install um, our instruments since they are all portable applications. You can, for example, carry them on a, on a pen drive. Inside this folder, you will find a fonts folder. Select them all, right click, more options and install for all users. Now you can simply launch the instrument uh, executable file. You will find a, a file with .exe file with a, with a different icon. Then click start. And now you can play the instrument. Anyway, these are MIDI instruments. This means they are mute. They don't have any pre-installed uh, sound on them. In order to make them sound, you need an external application. So let's do some setup for to make them sound. In order to do so, uh, first of all, uh, since they are MIDI instruments, you need to create, uh, if you want to make uh, your PC work as a sound synthesizer, you need um, a MIDI port. In order to create uh, a virtual MIDI port inside your PC, you can use this program called Loop MIDI by Tob Tobias Ericsson. Click, uh, uh, go on, on, on the page and click download Loop MIDI. You will find this archive. Again, extract it and go through the setup application. Uh, which will um, install MIDI for you. Once you've, uh, once you've done so, uh, go on the application, you will find um, this, uh, this small icon on your, uh, on, your, on your taskbar. And create um, a MIDI port, a virtual MIDI port, like this. If you don't find this icon on your, on your taskbar, you can simply look for Loop MIDI on your, on your, on your start. Uh, okay, then you will need um, uh, via, uh, an host for uh, synthesizers. You can download VST host, for example. Look for the um, X64 version of the program. Download this zip and again extract it anywhere on your PC. <clears throat> Oops. Better if you extract it in a, in a separate folder. Okay, like this. Um, open this folder and you will find a uh, vstos.x application, launch it. Okay. L uh, this will be uh, the host application for our all of our uh, virtual instruments, um, which make uh, will make um, which will uh, have uh, be the sound for our our netitar, netticords, or resin instruments. But we need sounds now. 
and we can we can find VST uh, plugins on this site, plugins for free. Now you can find every kind of instruments here from like uh, drum drum synths or guitar, bass, piano, uh, string instruments. Uh, for for Netitar, for example, you can use a VSCO2 violin or a violin section, like uh, in this example. Take the uh, Win64 version of the instrument again, download it, and again extract it anywhere on your PC. Okay. Now the most important part is this uh, DLL file. You have to bring it into the uh, VST host application. With the default settings, it will be connected to our output, audio output. Make sure in devices MIDI that the loop MIDI part is selected as an input. So now we have our Netitar or Netichords or Resin or whatever uh, communicate to this uh, MIDI part, loop MIDI part, and this violin section receiving the MIDI input from, uh, from Netitar. So that's it. Now you can play. So again, head back to Netitar or Netichords so or Resin and launch it. Start it and make sure that the correct MIDI port is selected here. If you hear sound, the correct sound from, for example, our violin section, then the, this setup is done and you can play. Enjoy! <laughs>